one day my girlfriend Brooke and I decided to go on a cruise. Now I had never been on a boat in my life. Brooke had been on a couple of cruises I had not. So, you know, the day comes, we drive down to Miami, we get up on the boat, and I'm sick for the first day, like really sick. Can't keep anything down, you know, just throwing up. Finally, I get to keep where I can keep some water and some soda down, and I immediately just start hammering down drinks. We were living it up. I was eating like a bear out of hibernation and drinking like a parched hippo, having a blast. We come to the first stop in the boat. We get off the boat, go down in a little town or whatever. Everybody's shopping around, kind of staying in groups. I see a little roadway and some kids playing on it, kind of outside the little village. And I told Brooke, let's go up this way and see what's going on. She advised against it, but I'm hard-headed and adventurous. I was like, come on, girl, let's go. I got us. So we walk up this way and up a few blocks, there's another village. We go into the village. People from the boat didn't go into this village. You could tell the looks we were getting. Suddenly a little boy runs up to us and he's got a little toy. Kind of looks like a little turtle he's playing with. He's hands, he's like, bye, bye, bye. So I just pull out a $20 bill and buy it from him. The kid goes crazy. So the little boy's running around happy. Suddenly he takes off. We're standing there maybe 30 seconds to a minute just kind of looking around, and he comes walk, running back down the hill. At the top of the hill is a man and woman. I guess his mom and dad. He's trying. He grabs my arm. He drags me up to the top of the hill. They want me to go in their house. I look back at Brooke. She's like, nope. Mm -mm. I'm like, come on. He, it's good. Look how happy this kid is. Good. So we go in. His mom feeds us dinner. It was okay. It was very different, but it was okay. We, fin we finish eating dinner. We say thank you. Suddenly his mom gets up and goes over to a little bassinet looking thing, gets a very little baby and brings her over and puts her in Brooke's arms. So Brooke and I are loving on the baby for a few minutes, you know, holding it, kissing on it. It was a beautiful little baby boy. So I was like, Brooke, it's time to go. Brooke goes to hand the baby back to the mom and the mom's not having it. She starts saying, home, home, you home. She wanted us to take this baby home, guys. She was dead serious. She didn't want to take this baby back. We didn't know what to say. What happened next, y'all, is crazy. Y'all give me a follow if you see it on the FYP, repost it. It's the only way stories get out now. I got plenty more on where that comes. Y'all won't believe what happens in part two.